We have much to be done, friends. Good morning, friends. Brandar has returned. From quite a nice rest. It does look like the sun is falling in the sky. Which is a, a fortunate thing for me. <sighs> Some part of me told me to feed upon these hounds. But I have quite a disdain for their blood. My plan is to head north. I think the uh, colder climate should suit me a bit better. Now that I'm becoming a little more dead inside. Vampirism is not a laughing matter, friends. This much I know for sure. But Brandar will do his best to retain his humanity. I do worry just a little bit. And I'm not sure where I left my Richard. Hmm. No, never mind that. He shall find his way to me. As he tends to do. Quite an intelligent young horse he is. Not so young anymore, I suppose. He's been aging just a little bit. And you did not learn, huh? Yeah. There you are. Seems I need to charge my weapons just a little bit. I thought maybe the uh, vampirism would help me somewhat. As vampires are known for some sorts of magic. But unfortunately the destruction magic that I know is not able to be infused into the sword directly. But that's alright. There is another oblivion gate just down the way. But I'm not so much looking forward to that. I would like to head north. I've heard tales of Bruma. And I'd like to see this place, indeed. You, what are you doing here? Ah, not a friend. Ah, dodged it. We shall see how this goes. Hmm. Perhaps you would like some flame. Ha! Ah. And I miss. Hmm. His arrows are not too strong, thankfully. Hmm. Oh! Oi. All right then. You want it? Come and get it. Yeah. Ha! Yeah. That's right. Undeflected. He's quite strong. You've got a bit of a uh, nice armor there, friend. Shame that it I won't save you. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> What's the matter? Mm. Tired? He has done some work. Ah! Die, I've been knocked down. Something I need to be aware of with oh. these mace wielders. Ha! Ah. Kill! I've missed. Come then. Are you going to shoot me? Oh. Surely he is. This ah. He does end here, friend. Mm. His flesh so supple. I should like to sink my teeth into it. Mm. But I must resist the temptation. This is something that the Bosmer Elves would do. Cannibalistic wood people, you see. Brandar is not like such. But I did seem to sleep the day away without much trouble. I did worry that uh, upon waking I would be dissolved to ash by the sun. This vampirism is something that I will need to uh, consider. Especially before heading into Skyrim. Khajiits are not uh, necessarily welcome in Skyrim. And I think a vampire Khajiit should be even less welcome, indeed. Hmm. 
Perhaps slinking through some more caves would be quite a good idea. I should like to find some relics. Not for my own profit, of course, but to release them back into the world where they surely belong. Of course, a short stay in Brandar's bag is, is a good thing for them, you know. Get the rust off, that sort of thing. Hmm, what do my eyes see here? Ah. Have I been to this place? Up, up. Ah, the fires are burning. And the mage just there. I don't think he is the friendly sort. We must move slowly, quietly into position. Hopefully he is not uh, alerted by any friends. Luckily my acrobatic skill does not seem to decrease with the vampirism. It did make my bones ache just a little bit, friends. Yes, look at him. Looking for a fight, he is. And the fight has found him. But I must take the correct position. I should not like to flee this cave and end up in the arms of the wizard. Hmm. I'll take this back. Just down here. Must be very careful. Slowly but surely. Hmm. Now where has he gone? The blue robes do not help to hide him. But I seem to have lost track of him. Perhaps I have a spell I could use. Although this distance is not very long on this one. It might help me to get the jump. Fort rails. Hmm. Well, this mage is going to get railed. Railroaded. Slowly, slowly, slowly. I think he did go out this way. And I do hear him. Yes. Just there. And fire. Wonderfully done. And he summoned a Dromora. This is not good. Do not run from me! Ah! This might be more than I can handle. I was hoping to take the wizard down before he realized what was happening. But it did not seem to happen in the way that I had hoped. And so we shall flee. Just for a little while. Ah... But it seems my strength is renewed in the night. It gives me some sort of vim and vigor, which I have not felt in quite some time. Not since being a tiny little kitten. He's still coming. I can only hope he's wasting some of his magic. And this will give me some time to recover. Quite a dangerous place, this oblivion. Much more dangerous than when I left it, I do believe. Oh yes. How's that? They can't seem to get me here. This is fortunate. He is quite a, an evil mage, summoning Dromora into this plane of existence. This is the sort of mage that I must get rid of. I don't believe it is an option any longer. How about... How about... Hmm. It does hurt. But if we stay just out of range... Should be just fine. And he does seem to have some healing spells as well. Luckily, Brandar has taken the high ground. Seems to be out of mana as well. Good. 
Wonderfully done. Let's not let this staff get away. Illuminate staff. Well, it fetches a pretty penny. I suppose I shall take. And I used a fair bit of arrows on him. Hmm. Potions of sorcery. And not much else for me here. I suppose since the mage has been taken care of, we should have a at least a look inside the fort rails. There may be even more magical implements inside, which might assist me on my journey. So long as I don't take another airship and crash it in a skooma binge. Hmm. Quite troubling, I think. Now where was the entrance to this? Second floor? Ding ding! How I wish I had some uh, vertical transport device. You could push, push a button and it takes you up to the second floor. I think that would be quite a wondrous thing. Brandar would like to see. Oh, headless statue. They don't much like that emperor, I do suppose. And it is on the third floor. Let us be very careful, friends, for I have no magic left. Ah, have we been spotted again? Hmm. He did not spot us coming down this way. Where? Well, I suppose he shall follow us inside, if he is that determined. Oh my. It seems a crash of boulders down this way. Which is a good reminder. We should be very careful of traps. These wizards are known to set up some nasty things. Explosive fire and whatnot. And I do believe I've explained the danger of fire to a furry furry kitty man. Hmm. So far, so good. But this seems to be the first chamber. Hmm. And look at this. They have a glowing eye on their forehead. Am I to presume that I should poke this with something? Hmm. I wonder if that gem is valuable at all. It doesn't seem that I can pry it out, unfortunately. Let's open the gate. Hmm. Cannot quite figure it out. There are some arrows for Brandar. Perhaps there is another way in. Hmm. Fort Rails already with the mysteries. No matter. I am not so curious. I'm sure there are Dramora spilling out of here every day, but have I not done enough to quell the flow? I think that I have, friends. But I will check the top. Just to see. Ah. Wondrous well. Some gold to line my pockets? Don't mind if I do. Alright, carefully, a little more carefully than that. Hmm. Did twist my ankle just a little bit. Perhaps my body is decaying somewhat due to this uh, disease. Polyf polyphilic hemorphilia, something of this name. Ah. And if I am doomed to be a, a beast of the night, I suppose it would behoove me. To head to the north, where it is colder. To hold my bones together just a little bit more. I can't seem to scale this mountain, especially without Richard's help. Where is that boy? Tell you what. He's so slinky. Goes, goes off, does whatever he wants. Mm. But overall, he, he is a good companion, yes. I shall not slight him, especially uh, if he is not here. 
I find that to be quite rude. As would uh, drinking the blood. I think drinking somebody's blood is quite rude. Does this turn them into a vampire as well? I should hope not, friends. I would hate to have that on my conscience. Cloud top. Hmm. Hmm. I think there is something here. And I fear to find out what. Whatever it is, there's a little chest. And I do love little chests. Big ones I am also fond of, but you can't uh, disparage the little ones. <laughs> uh, I'm unsure. Scared to uh, get up and fully run up this hill. Just in case there is a surprise waiting for me. I've had enough of my, my share of trolls and imps. Ah, ah. Carefully. Carefully. Yes. We will need to be much more careful now. I do think. If there's an entrance to this place, it is not so obvious. Hmm. I am... I am curious about what might lie inside Cloud Top. It's quite an interesting name. And luckily I know enough to decipher the sign. Ah, When I was a bit younger I did not enjoy reading so much. But th through my journeys I found that uh, it can be quite a helpful thing, indeed. Oh, look at this. What sort of statue this is. My goodness. A man with an eagle atop a horse. There is no inscription of the name, so I shall just assume that it is uh, of minimal importance. Surely it is of some importance. They did construct the statue of him, after all. But Brandar shall not waste any time trying to figure out the mystery. We have much to be done, friends. Did you hear this? Oh. Hello to you. Greetings. How's that? Ah! You did get me. But I got you back. I'm sure there is a nice pelt. Oh my. But again, I care not for the pelt so much. Yeah! Dog skin, infested with mites and the like. Mm. Not my favorite, that is for sure. That was a large wolf. Took quite a beating compared to his friend. But luckily, Brandar has what it takes. Ah. The fire here seems to have gone out long ago. Hmm. I have to wonder what this place was. What purpose did it serve? Cloud top. Perhaps it is just a... A lovely relic. Could have been someone's home. Though I doubt anyone would want to live this far in the mountains. Unless they were a dirty orc or some such. Orcs do love the mountains, but I think that is... Mostly because they are relegated there, due to uh, people's mistrust of them. They are somewhat similar to Khajiit in that way, I think. Hmm. Is this uh, nearing the top? The cloud top, as it were? <laughs> ah, colder and colder. Luckily, my fur shall keep me nice and warm. Although, the pads of my feet are feeling a bit numb already. Hmm. Surely this is the, the entrance. Mount Kolovia. K 
Kolovian Mountains, yes. And this is the the biggest, I suppose. It does not seem that there is a, an easy entrance. Which is a shame. Yes, it's been blocked off by a wall of ice. Hmm, perhaps I should try my fire spell upon it. Would this be enough to melt it? Mwah! Not at all. I don't have enough uh, study and destruction, I think. That's a shame. But on the plus side, we have come across the top of the mountain. So this should make an easy way to Bruma. I'll admit that I am a bit lost at the moment, but that is no matter. My goodness. Look at all of this. I must find a safe way down. If there is one. Okay, little bit. Crossy cross. And a lake. Is there some Nern route around this lake? Hmm. A family of deer in the distance. I should think that Nern root would not grow in such a cold climate, but for this water to stay here. It has to be a little warm, I would assume. Brandar is not going to be the one to find out, that's for sure. Hmm. One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again.